This is our 67 Volkswagen Beetle. This video will cover a few different things. First off, there will be a slow paced walk around of the car, and then following that, I will show close ups of all the cosmetic blemishes on it. Then after that, there will be some running and driving clips. So the car is a 67, being the first year of 12 volt, uh, and it's a true 17,000 mile survivor. Uh, the odometer does tick, and the story with the car is this. Uh, it was bought new at Lee Allen here in Chicago, and then around 85, 86, it was put into a storage unit. Uh, so we got a call a few months ago from the guy who owns the storage facility. Uh, he said he was selling his lot and he opened up one of the doors to find this Beetle, which looked to be really original, looked to be really nice, but it was all dusty. Uh, so we went over there and the brakes were all frozen up and you know we drag it out, bring it back to our shop and we have done a pretty thorough servicing on it. We did all four wheel cylinders and a you know, big brake job on it. Uh, you know, change the oil, plugs, wires, belts, um, you know, put a battery in it. The car actually had the original battery in it. Uh, it's never been repainted. It's, it's quite possibly the best survivor we've ever seen. A couple of very minor cosmetic things, but it's, it's pretty unbelievable. I mean, the interior is perfect. Uh, when we got to it, there were no front seats, so we consulted somebody from the Samba and found the correct seats, had them recovered in the correct material, still have the original stuffing in them. Um, so the front seats are replacements, but they're, you know, correct. Uh, rear and headliner, all that stuff's perfectly original. Car is pretty unbelievable. Uh, the tires are original. Uh, you know, odometer does tick. The radio works. Um, I mean, it truly drives as a brand new car, but with you know some clunking from the original tires. So here are the cosmetic flaws on the car. You got a little chip there on the hood. get down low is a couple more little chips and then the most severe spot on the car is right there the little collection of scratches assuming something rubbed up against it while in storage and then there's a light scratch over here kind of long but very light you can see the original paint is pretty phenomenal um, you know mirror like finish it's it's time capsule uh, the chrome is all perfect. The weather stripping is original and not dry in the slightest. Really, really, really impressive. And you can see at the very bottom of the headlight, a tiny bit of aging right there. Um, but the chrome is all very good. Light lenses inside and out are all original. They're the Heli units. Original glass as well. It's all Volkswagen etched. See the weather stripping there. So the interior, uh, very impressive. No chips really or anything on the dash. Uh, the radio is functional. All the gauges are functional. The odometer does tick. The 17341 is accurate. Uh, Door panels are excellent. Bottom corners of the doors, um, super, super nice. I mean, really no rust at all. Car is bone dry. Comes with its original rubber mats and gray carpet. This is what the FBI will find, number six, what the FBI will find. And you can just see down on in here, the corners, the, the creases, everything is pretty much perfect. Uh, there's the plastic seatbelt holders that always, you know, kind of turn yellow and crack, and these things are mint. All the, all the interior trim is pretty unbelievable. This is probably the coolest part of the time capsuleness of this car. So in the front trunk, where the spare is. Um, obviously the original spare, uh, you can see that the rubber band on the jack is still in place. It's never even been touched. And then the, the piece of paper down there with the color options is there. Spare well's nice and dry. 